Yeah, hello everybody, and welcome back to the walkthrough. This is take two on Koopa Free Running here, because I just kept messing up the moves that I wanted to do. So let's try it again here. Lake Kingdom, regular cup. Let's -a go. So what I was trying to do is do that super shortcut I mentioned earlier with the fish, but it's very difficult to do. Uh, I'll, I'll give it another shot here, because, you know, for the sake of showing stuff for the maximum... Oh, oh. <laughs> it's not that big of a deal, this isn't the Master Cup, but yeah, I just want to kind of do things relatively smoothly, if I can help it, you know? <laughs> no, 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 don't. Don't, don't bounce off the ground there, you want to go down a little bit here. There we go. And look out. For the seaweed of doom, and I'm gonna skip the air, as risky as it may sound, because we're speed running here. <laughs> Dang it! Get out of my ow, my face, my way! All right, so here comes the fish trick, if I can pull it off. So what we're supposed to do, if I can pull it off, is actually maybe I should save it for the master cup. I'm supposed to jump out of the fish while jumping out of the water, using that, and then go and use that ledge to get up to the goal there, but... You know what, I will save it for the Master, just for the sake of... showing you the regular intended run, I guess you could say. <laughs> it's not that... It's not difficult to do this particular run, but it is when you want to do... the Master Shortcut of Doom. And... Yo! Happy days! Woohoo! Yeah, see, not that hard, but Master Cup is a coming. Yeah, I think I just should have saved that move for the Master Cup. And yeah. Just called it a day on that one. And then just actually put in the super effort for maximum speed on this one here. Alright. Master Cup. Yep, stairs are gone here too. <laughs> Take out the stairs just for the race, just to make sure no one is cheating the route. <laughs> I mean, who would cheat a route? <laughs> Surely no one would use a fish to get across. Oh, no, no. bad timing on my part. Ah, oh, I even hit my face on the ledge. Well, I might still be all right, I guess. Why didn't I come out of the roll when I want to? Co when I want to come out of the roll, I don't know. All I know is, I better do that fish trick, otherwise this is going to be a very sad run. Oh, jeez! <laughs> I even came out of my spin too early there. Uh, come on, baby, we can do this. We can do this. Actually, I might have already lost it, because I think the Golden Koopa does use the fish trick that I'm talking about here. Oh, shoot! Talking about here, but well, well, we'll see, I guess. Fish go, fish go, fish go! Yes! Now here we go. I need full concentration of you all pull this off. Ready? Three, two, one... Oh yeah! <laughs> it is quite tight on the timing there, that's why I was like, gotta concentrate, okay. You can also do a, a wall kick off the edge if you don't get high enough and to do a flip around and dive, like I did in the Koopa free running race back at the Cascade Kingdom, but as you see, it's not necessary if you get high enough like that, which I think is the faster strat for that. Anyway, Moon Power Moon, gimme! Yes! 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 Now, as for... Yeah, it just always looks so weird when that pops out like that. <laughs> as for Goombet back here, we gotta get a Goomba over to her some way, somehow, and that's actually kind of on the tricky side here. By the way, um, if you've completed a hint art, I never showed you this before, there's a little check mark next to it, both off and on the actual screen there. Alright, so... We need to, like... It's kind of tricky to pull this off because of the distance! Yeah, see what I mean? We need to get over to a safe ledge that will not dissolve the Goomba. We, we've got unlimited Goomba spawns here, so it's not that big of a deal, but it's still kind of tricky to pull this off. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> or maybe I did it from up higher? 
Now, I guess I'll try it up higher, but I'm, I thought I did it on, on the lower rail before. Let's see here, because, yeah, I don't think Goombas will make it over there or from here, will they? Will they? Maybe? Oh, no! <laughs> yeah, it's just, it's just kind of dicey to get a Goomba there, and this is the only spot that has Goombas. Oh, wait a second, isn't this a... Uh... Well, <laughs> little Goombas, but, or micro Goombas, I should say, but not a moon or something like that, but anyway. Come on, now. Alright. I guess... I, 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 mm, I don't know, it's just so, so tight. I jump! Wait, wait, oh, I accidentally twitched. Oh, shoot, well... <laughs> uh, well, well, <laughs> come on now, we can do this. Yes, yes, I know, high jump is key, but it's still, still kind of tight. And I think, I don't think I was high jumping properly, actually, there. Oh, I guess, yeah, I guess I wasn't just, okay. <laughs> I mean, I was just regularly jumping poorly, or, I don't know, well. Maybe I made a mountain out of a molehill there. But anyway, you just need one Goomba there to say hello, express your love, and kind of scam her out of a moon. Because what she doesn't know is that we're actually Mario! <laughs> Alrighty. <laughs> uh, I guess I should flop up there, I suppose, probably. Because, yeah, there's a little something over there. Now, it's not really, like, even at, uh difficult to reach location or anything like that. It's just, I don't know, it's just right there for whatever reason. It just sits there right in front of the cage and you know, you know full well you did not miss seeing this before. Oh, no, 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 no. There's no way you could have missed that before. <laughs> uh, I guess I could take the Koopa free running route through here because I thought there was something on the path under, well, I don't know. Maybe there wasn't something on the path there. I mean, maybe there is... Whoops, totally missed. I just want to take a look here really quick before... Oh, it's a bird! Birds! <laughs> Luckily, it was landed on the pillar there, but... Oh, birds! Birds! And I really, I could... Really off track there with the camera, but anyway. Alright, so let's just take a look-see here. Is that really that much? Ow. <laughs> not what not much in terms of what the moon block unlocked. Uh oh, oh sure, you grab onto the wall. Uh let's see. So it's like right above there. I think you need the flower to get to that. If I recall correctly, probably, or maybe use a fish, but I'll try the flower first. Ah, I keep missing that! <laughs> maybe that's why I was doing so badly with the with the jumps on the wall and the failed runs, I was just like, I don't know, I'm like mistiming or mis-aiming my shots. High flying leap is done. What is directly below here? It is... Oh, um, I guess I should show this too. Besides the new dialogue, of course. Um, I was told that you can't, that you could have actually gotten the Captain Toad dealio when I was through here before, but... I just left it thinking I couldn't, but I guess you could. And I just want to hear some uh, shop bubbles you could swim right up to. I just want to see if there's any new dialogue. <laughs> well, I, sometimes I take a fish, sometimes I use my regular body. It all depends. Oh yeah, there's a seed here now. I was planning to go grow flowers, but I lost my seed in a spiky tunnel. Oh, so the seed is back. Oh, oh there was something back in that other tunnel. But, uh, I was going to show you here that you can indeed make it through this without um, actually needing a fish to go through here. Yeah, it's very deep indeed, and you actually get uh, different, I think you get different dialogue for it as well if you make it through. I don't know. Oh! Pika Gam, please, don't twitch. So yeah, I just want to kind of show you that this is indeed possible to do. I mean, yeah, you will probably take a little bit of damage on your way down, as is kind of the uh, nature of this sort of risky method. <laughs> and... Oh, no, no, no! Oh, 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 oh! You know I had that! Well, I mean, yes, I did run myself into the fishbowl, but still, I was, it was just like the two flops that I had there, 
just got me. <laughs> All right, let's do it one more time. Just a little bit smoother, though, this time. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. Time those ground pounds well and time them true. It's okay if we take damage just as long as we make it in with one health to spare. <laughs> I think that's actually the first time I drowned in this entire walkthrough, because everything went pretty, pretty smoothly. Other than, actually, I didn't, don't really even think I took damage from the water in other places. So, but yeah, I guess you could see, no problem reaching this here. Okay, there's sort of a problem, but. <laughs> oh, and by the way, those uh, seaweeds I never really pointed out before. They sort of resemble sequins. I wonder if it's maybe a slight reference to those mermaid pillows that have the uh, flippy sequins on them. Anyway, I need to get that seed for the lock lady over there now that I'm done demonstrating and talking about stuff there. So she said that she's seen a seed in a spiky tunnel. And where there's a spiky tunnel, it's kind of only over here. So <laughs> let's go ahead and spiky tunnel it up. Yes, I do enjoy the water plaza. I enjoy this whole place. It's so atmospheric. But yeah, I'm looking for a seed, and I'm gonna get a seed. Oh, there's the seed. How convenient. I don't know if I should take it around. Yeah, I should probably just take it around this way. I think it's a little bit faster than taking the other route. Because I won't be able to grab a fish while I'm holding on to a seed, so... The thing about that is I might be pushing air. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. Still gotta do ground pounds. <laughs> and I'll just take it around this way. And otherwise, you know, my, my usual air refill is either the bubbles or the fish. But I'd, I'd only really be able to use bubbles that way if I were to take in the other route there. And it may, I don't know, maybe it's a little bit faster this way anyway, too. But I just wanna be sure that I get it there. Got it? Good. So let's start sinking. And drinking. Well, maybe not. That might be unhealthy. This is seawater. You can go crazy with that. No, it's actually lake water. <laughs> they could be full of bacteria. Uh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. oh what? well, that worked out. It worked out. And now we wait. Unfortunately, there are no gushins here, so we've just got to kind of wait this time for real Z's. Now, uh, thank you, thank you for the welcome, but... What about something directly above here? I've seen something pointed out there, but I want to make sure that I clear all the X's this part, if at all possible. And, you know, probably get some hints from the hint toad as to stuff that I overlooked, forgot, etc, etc. Is it this? Is it this now? Because I remember saying that there was, yeah, there was going to be something here later. Voila! Rooftop of the water plaza! Now there is something here. Unless that was the... Yep, that was the... No, that wasn't the X. That was the other X. So what is that X? Uh, we'll see. Uh, I, uh, these girls here are looking for us to wear certain outfits, by the way. I'll do those like in one fell swoop. Uh, I just want to sort of first take a look-see around here. Kind of pinpoint where that is here. It's like, it is like directly below here. Uh, well, obviously it's not, probably not directly below there, but yeah, it's probably something in here. Maybe something directly above. Hmm. Hmm. I don't see any like special shimmering spots on the ground or something like that. See, so, yeah, I don't remember. Why don't I talk to you again? <laughs> so yeah, I don't remember. You're welcome. I don't remember what the what that was referring to. Unless it's something. <laughs> it's probably the lock ladies. I guess they're seeing some nice new dialogue here to boot. Hello. Look at it. It's the lock lady dress. The Lake Kingdom is back to normal at last. And you rescued the Peach Bride Traveler. Love is really the greatest inspiration. Lock Lady dress really is very pretty. Yes, in indeed it is, but I can't go into first person view to show it, so what it glows. Um, well, I can't just show it that way, but details. Okay, so. Is it something way up above there? I don't remember. 
At the very least, I was able to show some new dialogue, though, so that's nice. <laughs> Actually, you know what it might be? I just realized... It might be in that underground area, well, deep underwater uh, area where Captain Toad is hanging out. So let's go down with a fish this time so we can have a more relaxed exploration. Because you know there's a little bit more uh, walking room in here. Well, I mean, swimming room, but details! <laughs> By the way, you can see the little X on your compass over there as well, but it's not quite as precise as if you're looking at the map. But okay, so... Oh, for the love of Arceus, it was down here. Ah! And I came down here two times before to demonstrate something else, and... Ah! 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 Let's get some hints. Alright, we're done! So what do we have here? These, I think, are the... Th yeah, the three... Girls, I want to see us in different outfits, but I'm gonna be mainly focused on the uh, other ones around here. Oh yeah! How could I have forgotten the binoculars? <laughs> oh, of course, of course. Because there's one flying ship out there now. Yeah. I guess I forgot about them because I didn't see more flying ships, and yeah, it's usually like a. Where's Waldo type of dealio, but in this case, no, it's just one. Alright. Taxi flying through Lake Lamode. I guess... Alright, I'll actually go to the terrace because Peach is up there. I might as well finally get her. <laughs> She's right there. Woo! I can't decide, it's lovelier here. The people or the architecture? Is this where I love it? Dress luckily just the beach was war was made? Oh hey, a moon power moon came floating along. It'll be safer with you. Woo indeed. Peach in Lake Kingdom. Huzzah! I wonder what there is to see above the clouds. Probably something worth seeing, hmm? Cloud Kingdom is up next. And no new dialogue, alright. So, besides those three, what are these two over there? They're surrounding this donut. It's probably something directly straight down, like probably ground pound the top of this pillar or something. Maybe? Maybe? Oh, it is! Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why you ran for me, because you know I'm just gonna... Thank you. <laughs> it's not, not really my find, I used the X. Around the broken pillar. Okay, so that was one of the two, but the other one is on the other side of that. Is it referring, still referring to that pot? Because uh, if so, I can't get that now, as it's still blooming. So I guess I could do the clothing one now. I suppose. It'll just be basically me cutting back and forth between the clothing shop and here. I think I've got all the clothes necessary to do this now, so. Let's see what they want. Basically, I'm going to be going from you guys down through there into the shop on the upper level. And I'll start from left to right. Oh yes, I am one of the fabulous style sisters. Inspire me with space clothes. Nothing about you says space right now. Explore a new... Fr oh, maybe I don't have this stuff now. Or at least I don't have that one now. Because I didn't... Because the... Um, the moon shop wasn't open when I was up there before. Avast, I be captain of the spile, sisters! Show me pirate clothes, you scurvy dog! Those I have! <laughs> uh, cowboy clothes. Howdy, partner! Well, this western right now is a bowl of spaghetti. Okay, so I guess I shall go change. Yay! Cowboy outfits! So it looks like I may end up going right to left here. Howdy, partner. Style sister wants to take a gander at some cowboy clothes. Yeehaw! You're a cowboy from hat to heel. Take this moon power moon for a badge. There's a new sheriff in town. Oh! That old west style. Giddy up. My next line will be as western as a sunset. Next up, pirate clothes. Let's go. Actually, couldn't I like 
warp to the water plaza display window instead of just swimming down through that? Yeah, that's actually a little bit better. A little bit more efficient. Pirate stuff is pretty close to the far end in my current layout. And you know, I can't use the uh, thing that I wanted to use to get out of there and back up there really quick because the elevator type uh, thingy is on the floor higher than that. And yeah, I just I just ended up swimming outside, but it doesn't really ma much matter because it's pretty easy to get here, as you can tell. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, that's it. Now you are a pirate dreaded across the seven seas. I grant this moon power moon for your help. Yar, worth it. Woo! That trendy pirate look. And alas, yeah, I don't have the space stuff for her on the on the left there, so. Alas, alas, I will have to wait on that. <laughs> Although, I could... No, no, I don't know. I'm, I don't Because I have to go to the moon, and then back here, and... How is the plant doing, anyway? <laughs> oh, man! <laughs> Maybe I should just... With things out and end off the part here. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when this thing is hopefully finally bloomed. This could take a while.